hello and welcome to informatica video kb session this is raja and in this session we are going to see how to configure email alerts in informatica domain so the agenda for the day is how to send a sample email using smtp server through command line and configuring the smtp server in informatica and how to subscribe to alerts and how to view the alerts a quick demo and the screenshots of the alerts received so sending email using SMTP server through command line you first need to log in into your server box Unix box where your Informatica is installed and you need to go through these commands I will show you a demo of the same so here is a sample mail which I got from the command line so next coming to configuring SMTP server in Informatica you need to log in into your administrator console go to domain tab properties and there SMTP configuration area you need to edit and give the necessary properties so how to subscribe to alerts after giving the necessary details in the SMTP configuration you need to go to manage preferences edit and then you need to select subscribe for alerts and click OK so coming to viewing the alerts so you would get the alerts when uh, domain and service notification emails for certain events so the log manager log alert notification delivery success or failure in the domain on the service log so if you see in this screenshot uh, in the domain log you would see that whether the mail was sent successfully or not you would see a log means alert message over there so coming to the demo so I logged into my Unix box where my Informatica installation is there. So I am checking. I am checking my SMTP server whether it is listening on that port or not. I am giving a dummy mail ID from which the mail, mail would be sent. So it said the sender mail ID is okay. Now the recipient mail ID. So some dummy mail ID. So it said recipient is also okay. Now the data and subject. some text so here you could see that the mail is queued for delivery so I think so from here you can check that uh, your SMTP is sending the mail properly or not later I would quit we'll log in into the admin console and configure the SMTP I am in the admin console page so I am logging in as an administrator so click on the domain go to properties tab scroll down so here you would see SMTP configuration so you your SMTP server over here. Okay, after giving your SMTP server, just give the mail ID from which the mail would be sent. Click OK. then go to manage preferences 
and here if, if you can see that subscribe for alerts is now so click on edit check it and click ok and ok so next you need all note to check that whether the administrator has any email configured to which the mail should be sent so go to administrator so if you see here there is no mail configured so I will configure xyz group the rate of informatica.com so that if there is any service terminator and expect or something so the mail would be go going to that group so I would show you a sample on how it works so if you see here I have an IS named as IS91 HF6 so this one is available so I will go to the logs I need to find the process ID and I will kill it so right click on here and here you will get a process so click on that and search so you could see here the process id as 14801 right ok now we will go to the unix box where this is this process is running so now uh, i am on my unix box so if you see this it's 14801 right so i would kill it so that i need to receive a notification saying that the process has terminated unexpectedly so I killed it so if you see the screenshot over here so I received a mail saying that the service process on node this one for service is underscore 91 hf6 terminated unexpectedly so similarly if a domain goes down or something so you would receive the notifications if you configure the SMTP so you could get more information regarding the same uh, go to any of your client like designer workflow manager and click on help content administration and domain management and alert management so there you get more information regarding the same so we would like to hear from you so you could write to us at support videos at the rate of informatica.com thanks for your valuable time